Good morning. I got tagged a little bit ago on a Facebook post. And I'm sure probably many of you have either heard of this or other events, other groups. I'm talking about the situation in Texas at the border. And I was tagged in a Facebook post that gave a website and all of that. And I'm telling you, it's the same. I can tell by the the way the website's done. It's the same folks that were behind the convoy, the trucker convoy. Um, this particular group, I'm sure there are a plethora of groups out there that are hurriedly setting up uh, to go to the border to assist their fellow Americans, you know, um, their, their brother and sister Texans uh, with their cowboy hat, their boots, and their sidearm. Sounds cool, right? I've got one word. Possibly two, I don't know. I'll have to ask Webster when I see him next. Honeypot. Honeypot. Stand down. If you do not think that they will use anything, including your cell phone data, against you in a court of law, you haven't been paying attention. They're including now going after people from January 6th that never even entered the building, that were just on the grounds. They've got cell phone data saying that they were just merely on the grounds. I think January 6th was a setup by both sides. I think people were set up. I think this is a set up the website that was posted is this right here and like I say it looks a lot a lot like the convoy website I think whoever did this website was responsible for the convoy website this particular group now again I'm sure there are multiple groups this one here is the Take Our Border Back Southern Border Convoy. And the website's TakeOurBorderBack.com. But my advice is to stand down. Do not fall for this from any of these groups. When they are going after people that did not even breach the threshold of the Capitol building... You have to be aware of how they are using, they are misusing the laws against us and not allowing us to use the law as it was intended when it was written to set this country straight. And there's not enough people in mass to back up the people that really truly want to set this country straight to put the quote unquote fear of God into those in control I'm pretty sure if we pulled this off anyway it would have told us about it in the good book the good book says we don't we don't win this one the father will win it in the end. But this one? Now, we don't win it. Doesn't mean that we aren't supposed to fight like hell. Absolutely does not mean that we're all supposed to just lay down and give in. Oh, hell no. You leave as many and as deep marks as what you possibly can. But do it wisely. Don't get caught up in some kind of nonsense that your emotions got you involved in. Stand down. They are going to have a field day with folks showing up at that border. Shalom. Shalom.